Hey, I'm Hannah Weiss, the Education Manager at the Science Museum of Western Virginia, and this is your moment of STEM. And this week, I'd like to talk about fireflies. And no, I don't mean the way too short-lived and incredibly awesome sci-fi series. I mean lightning bugs. Those bugs that I grew up chasing all around my neighborhood in summer evenings. Fireflies are really, really cool, but we're actually seeing a population decline. We're losing them in the wild. And one of the reasons that might be is due to light pollution. Now you wouldn't think light would affect these animals, but because of the way that they find their mates, it really has a huge effect on them. You see, fireflies, the ones that light up anyway, use bioluminescence, light that they create in their bodies to find their mates. So bioluminescence is totally different from fluorescence. Fluorescence is something that some other animals do. They light up usually in reaction to something. It's more of a glow. So scorpions, for example, they glow under a black light. Fireflies, on the other hand, they actually make that light in their body. They use two chemicals, a reaction between two chemicals, that when they mix together, creates this light, kind of like a glow stick. They also have a translucent panel in their bodies that lets us see this light. Now for fireflies, this light is incredibly important because they light it up in specific patterns, many of them, in order to attract a mate. Different species use different patterns of lights. So a male firefly and a female firefly of the same species can find each other. Or, <laughs> there's also another cool thing fireflies do. There are these predatory female fireflies that'll copycat or mimic the pattern of different species. So they'll light up just like a female of a species and a male firefly will come find them and then end up a snack. So really, really cool, unless you're the male firefly. Firefly lights also do another really crazy cool thing in this area. There are some species of fireflies, especially the ones that you can find around here, that'll light up in synchronization. So they'll light up together. So you'll see these amazing, amazing patterns of light happening all over the night, usually in around June. So they're really, really awesome to see if you can get out to see them. I'm Hannah Weiss from the Science Museum of Western Virginia, and I cannot wait for the fireflies to come out.